My name is Ted Barr, and as many things in my life that happened, um, things occurred in a very random, uh, random way. Um, I never planned to be an artist. I never planned to to paint. From the time I remember myself, in very uh, from very young age, I was uh, writing. Uh, I published um, so far um, children books and allegory books and short stories but never painted. Till the age of 40, I never touched a, a pencil or a, or a drawing pen. Uh, then something happened uh, suddenly as a lot of uh, things occurred like that in my life. Um, my wife saw me drawing, scribbling down with the kids when they were very young. And she said to me, you have to be a painter. You have to paint, you have to paint. She was very persistent about it. And I took um, a workshop in a, in a place in, in the hometown I lived there. Um, and they put uh, like a still life, um, a, a plant and um, a flower and a towel. And they said, okay, paint it. And I, I was there about three or four months. It, uh, and I came back home and I said, sorry, it's not for me. I wasn't uh, meant to, to be a painter. Um, I, I was totally disconnected from, uh, from uh, those actions. And then my wife uh, told me, she said to me, listen, um, the fact is that you haven't um, found your uh, true teacher, because if you'll find the teacher, you'll be a painter. And <laughs> she was again very persistent about it. And then uh, by, by chance, I, I met a friend of mine and he, um, and he referred me to a, a painter in the old Jaffa named Shlomo Tzafrir. Uh, he was uh, one of the uh, most renowned painters then in Israel. I'm speaking about uh, um, the, uh, 1997, something like that, 1996. And um, I learned with Shlomo Tzafrir for seven years. For seven years I was um, his, own, uh, his own disciple. Um, and uh, we learned seven years, the basic, he learned, he, he, he taught me the basic of paintings. The basic, um, for two years, for example, he didn't uh, allow me to touch uh, paints at all, only charcoal and, uh, and, uh, and uh, pencils. And then only uh, when he died, he died in uh, 2002, uh, when he died, I started to paint my own uh, my own things, the things that, that live uh, w within me for a long time, which were uh, deep space images. The deep space images that were sent from uh, the Hubble telescope, galaxies, stars, red giants, quasars, uh, white dwarfs. Um, and those um, uh, celestial elements started to appear on the canvases. And slowly, slowly I developed um, a technique, um, a painting technique, which is I believe unique to me, which is um, levels, layers, and I paint in layers, and, and each layer uh, consists of uh, tar, coal tar, <coughs> diluted by turpentine, um, oil colors, acrylic colors, and lacquers. So it's one layer, I have to wait till it dries, another layer, another. I have paintings for 20 or 22 layers, each painting. Uh, usually the canvases I use are big because I need space to uh, move the color. All my colors are moved on the canvas. I don't stir colors on cans. I, I uh, stir them only on the canvas. And uh, instead of pencils, um, I use sushi sticks to move the color from place to place.